Okay, I'm going to show how to add to screen a history about the system alarms and also um, the current alarm that uh, is occurring as a system in the system. So first thing to do is that um, you should come to your project here in our project three. Go to alarm. In alarm, you should choose system alarm. So after that, please enable system alarm. And you can choose um, whatever information you need here. Just CPU or all of them. Just select what you need. And basically that's it. So after that, you click OK. Keep here as historical. So after that, you add to your screen what you need. So you need history. So you have an object here. And uh, it's called Alarm Display System. This one is like uh, historic and it comes in this format with um, these buttons here for a cursor so you can move upwards, downwards to select what alarm you should, you want to highlight or to recognize or delete, delete etc. And if you just want to show the current alarm, you come here and select system alarm display. This one will show only the current alarm that's occurring. Okay. Another option is that uh, you may uh, create a kind of um, a ticker here where the alarm is just passing through uh, the screen and showing which alarms are uh, in effect alarms are occurring right now so this option is alarm pop-up display you may enable here and check system alarm so after doing that you you have uh, various um, options that you can select here such as um, if you were you're going to show just one alarm or multiple alarms if more than one is happening and um, yeah, so things like that is more like a statical thing. But the point is that after enabling this and transferring to HMI, what will happen is that whenever an alarm comes up, it will, you have a ticker that will open here, either on the top or on the bottom. It's, um, you can set that by uh, this um, alarm pop-up display and it will start showing here in the sticker which alarm or which or more than one alarm is happening in this situation so basically it's like that another important thing is that um yeah system alarms are only available on gt27 so if you have gt21 uh, or something like that unfortunately system alarms are not available as this okay so this is important to to understand so if in your case uh, you cannot see these options, it's probably because your uh, HMI is not a GT27. Okay, so that's it. Thank you for watching.